Okay. Next up, let's go to Heartbroken. Uh oh, Heartbroken. Heartbroken, are you there? <clears throat> what up, man? What's up, brother? Oh, what's up? Do you have questions about man? your uh, wedding or something, Heartbroken? <laughs> no. <laughs> uh, I have a very peculiar situation here. Hit, hit uh, us with it. So uh, I met this girl three years ago, and she was a single mother of two, and uh, we were got really close for a year, really good close friends, and then we uh, got even closer. Mm. We're exclusively fucking for eight months. Okay. And everything was sweet. Everything was great. Uh, okay. Everything was great until we added a title to the situation, <laughs> and you we were dating say. for the last year. Okay, keep going. And, so you were date. So you were fucking for eight months. Yeah. And, and you you didn't you didn't live together. You lived lived in separate no, places. Separate separate places. Gotcha. Okay, interesting. Hooking up for <clears> for <throat> eight months, and then in kind of an organic way, and then uh, you then we, for a year we you were in a you were like we're t we're boyfriend girlfriend now. Yeah yeah yeah. Okay. And everything was cool for a while. I caught her cheating on me twice mm. in that year. I took her back both times, mm. uh, you know, because again, the kids, every, they're all I know. It was like, it was, it was just, it was okay, I guess. <clears throat> you're you're a cool. good guy. Cause, cause citing the kids as a reason to take her back means you're a good person. Cause other people will be like, oh, bitch, you have kids. You think I'm yeah. fucking putting up with you sucking dick on the side, but you're like these uh. kids, I'm worried about them. You're yes. toast. You're too nice of a human being, man. <laughs> anyway, tell us how it goes. Fill us in. Give us all of it. All right. So uh, last month, I uh, took a charge, a felony charge, mm. for dabs in the state of South Dakota. Oh, my God. What a fucking ridiculous place. <laughs> I Fuck know. the Dakotas. Um, and it, uh, I took it, and I stopped her from catching the charge herself because, again, the kids uh and oh uh, my god dude you're a fucking idiot <laughs> they were her dabs or were they both they, of your dabs they were both of our dabs okay all right all right all right that's a little like, better that's a little better too. it yeah, should only have been one of you that's like, fair, no no that's no fair. they're all mine it's all mine everything's mine <clears throat> they're like you sure i was like yeah yeah everything's mine no no that's uh, better because they would have just gotten both of you for the same exact charge yeah uh she uh left me four days later Damn. And uh, she she's like, I want to take a break. I want to take a break because, you know, the stipulation we got evicted from our place Jeez. was that her, par her parents were going to take her in. She had to leave me. What? So she's like, yeah. How old, they, they how old like are you both, by the way? <laughs> they don't like me because I'm brown. I see. How old are you guys? Uh, how old are you guys? I'm, tw I'm 27 and she's 24. <laughs> I see. Okay. Damn. And uh, so they took her back and uh, we took a break. You know, or, or so I thought. So for two weeks, she's telling me, you know, that she really wants to be with me. She misses me, blah, blah, blah. And she's like hitting me up for every problem that she has. And I'm there for her, of course, stupidly. And uh, I get screenshots from one of my buddies. And uh, she was on Tinder day one. Yeah. Of us. Uh, yeah. yeah of and course, uh, dude. I was like, holy shit. So I hit her up and she's leaving me on scene like crazy about this situation. Yeah. So I do what any. Uh, uh -oh. guy in my position would do and i signed into her social media oh and no dude i'm gonna dumb down the number because i no. don't want to make her look bad but between 15 dudes uh she's sending them all the same shit all the same nudes and i fucking lost my shit yeah uh i was just kind of looking for some ancient greek wisdom bro on what do i do with this what because, do you do uh, <laughs> What are you what talking? Bro. Congratulations. You don't have to be a stepfather at 27 anymore. Yeah. You're single. Yeah. Find a good fucking dabs attorney. Start your life over, bro. There's no what do you do? What are you fucking talking about? What do you do? It's just, I just, I, I miss her. Regardless yeah, dude. Of everything. That's how it works. That's how that works. It's going to suck. But like, come on, man. I mean, really think about what you just told us and the fact, like, hey, man, this fucking girl who's, uh, this, like, you know, she clear, whatever, this single, this young single mother of two whose parents don't like me, who I took a drug charge for, who has cheated on me multiple times, asked to take a break, and has been sending nudes to 40 men and on Tinder, 
What do you think I should do about that? There's not even a question here, buddy. The, like, what, what else do you want? The world has made the decision for you, right? She's immature. She's going to string you along. She'll try and take advantage of you in any way that she can if you're going to let yourself do that. She doesn't give a fuck. She's so out. She couldn't be more out. She's like, damn, yes. I can get away with this too. It's yeah. like, damn, he'll take a charge. Damn, he'll do I can whatever fuck I, around and right. I can come back. Right. And, and so your challenge here is completely cut her out of your life. And by the way, I blocked her. Huh? I blocked her on everything. More than that. We've all been, we've done the initial block, and then a week <laughs> later, we're creating new fucking Instagram accounts. We're creating a fake like bunny page. To be like, <laughs> Mr. Hops, the little influencer. And it's like, just to see what the fuck she's up to. You got to mm. stick. You got to. Bro, you're in a tough spot here. Because I'm going to guess she. you must have either not gotten that much pussy before or she had incredible pussy or something. She seems insane. Two kids kind of young. <laughs> completely unstable. She incredible. probably sucked dick out of control if I had to guess. Um, you're spot on, man. I know, you know, I, I, I'm a, I'm a, I'm an observer. I'm a keen observer of human nature and, and you're just, you're fucked, bro. You're fucked. You got to yeah. stay completely away. There is no conversation. There's no nothing. You have to, you have to, uh, keep your distance. I would say try and date. You know what I mean? Uh, just so that when she, not if, when she comes back to try and take advantage of you in some way, I don't know what that is right now, that you you have, you don't let that happen. It, you're, you're a weak man, I can tell. You're going to let her do it. So I say get a different girlfriend fast so that like, <laughs> so that like you just aren't tempted to go back to this girl. You're just... You can't, dude. You got to be completely out of here, bro. You're not going to win with her, man. There's yeah. no positive outcome here for you. Zero. Zero. Yeah, I felt I felt like that was the problem. Yeah. <laughs> I, just, I think I needed to hear it from someone else. Yeah, you definitely did. Uh, you can't win. You're not going to you're not going to miraculous, miraculously find peace in this relationship no. with her ever. No. And she might at some point stop being a dumb bitch, but it will not be with you. It will not yeah. be with yeah. you. That's not how that's not how people work, bro. I'm sorry. So yeah, start fresh and listen. Call us back when you get other pussy. All right, man. Okay, that's you get your homework assignment. <laughs> Fuck someone I'll else. I'll update you on that. I'll update you on that. <laughs> All right, dude. Good All luck. Right, Sorry that you. happened, brother. Good luck. Uh, thank you. Bye, thank buddy. you, guys. Damn, Damn dude. I'd be heartbroken too. That's fucking brutal. Fucking all that shit in South Dakota. Oh. Live in South Dakota. Just gotta go to fucking jail. You can't smoke a fucking joint out there. That's so funny. We're a fucking dog shit town. Yeah, we should have told him to leave South Dakota. Tell him that. Tell him to go to a better place. Just leave South Dakota, dude. <laughs> Fuck, I feel bad. I should have. Yeah, I should have given him more. I just, I was so appalled by the. <laughs> Sometimes people just have to say these things out loud to a neutral party. Yeah. Like when you say it to your friends and they're they're all wrapped up in your bullshit. Yeah. But you need to honestly most of this show is having people say out loud what the problem is so they can hear how fucking stupid they are. Totally. All right. 